What we're looking at here is data acquisition software that works with a line of process controllers made by Automation Direct, the solo controller line. These controllers connect together using an RS-45 Modbus based network, and this is the configuration software we have for them. We can actually connect to several of the controllers that we have on our network, and we all have them numbered. So I'm going to connect to controller number one right there. You can see a connection is made, and when it comes up, it pulls up all the parameters for that controller. I can go to controller number three, I'll connect to that. Controller number three pops up, and I can click on it, and it also brings up a set of uh, parameters I can look at for that controller. I'll go here for controller number four, connect, and controller number six, connect. So I'm showing all these different controllers here, and we can see the parameters inside. Now to take a look at the network itself, this is very, very messy because we literally threw this together in one hour. At the back of the computer, we're coming out of a serial port to a converter. This particular converter takes the RS-232 pulses and converts that to RS-45 voltage pulses. So this is strictly a, a layer one converter for the layer one of RS-232 to layer one of RS-45. The actual data formatting is Modbus, but that's a layer seven standard, so this converter really has nothing to do with that. It's simply converting voltage signals. This cable then runs up over here to this controller. Here's the back of one of the process controllers. And from there, it daisy chains over to the other side of the table. The yellow cable comes over here to this controller right here. We're connected right there to the RS-45 uh, Modbus terminals. Then the cable goes across the floor, comes over here to this controller, another one just like it. And we're also connecting to the RS-45 terminals. The cable from that goes over to the other side of the table. So jump to the other side, come around here, and we can see that cable daisy chains to this controller. And that has RS-45 connections on the back. That daisy chains one more loop, one more step to our final controller of the network. So we actually have uh, these five controllers connected our RS-45 network. They're all talking to the configuration software using the Modbus protocol. So back here at our PC, that's where the main connection is made. Our PC is functioning as the Modbus master. And then at the display of the PC, we can see the individual controller parameters pulled up one at a time.